And uh, right now, let's uh, have a listen to what Martin Butchkovsky had to say. He was in President's pool and landed in Smolensk an hour earlier than the plane of Oleg Kuchinsky tragically landed there. At the moment, the rescuers are trying to find the bodies, or to, re to recover the bodies, and the firefighters have finished putting out the fire. There was no explosion. Some eyewitnesses say that the plane, uh, before landing, uh, had dumped all the fuel. That's why there was no explosion, only a small fire took place. When the rescuers came to the site, they said at once there was no sense to call for ambulance because all the members of the delegation and the crew had died. The delegation was rather big. We don't know exactly who was had been on board, but the list of the delegation members bad, bore 120 people plus some members of the crew. Probably not all of them had arrived at the airport. As for the, uh, apart from the president and his wife, some other leaders of the Polish Republic were on board, including the deputy chairman of the marshal, uh, marshal par uh, of the parliament, members of the parliament, members of the president of the presidential office, and other officials, the military, some generals, head of staff, general staff of the Polish Republic, and heads of various uh, departments of the army. This is a horrible tragedy indeed. And that was the voice of Martin uh, Wojciechowski uh, we talked to earlier. Right now we are taking a look at uh, the pictures, uh, the live pictures that are coming to us from Warsaw, the Polish capital, and we're seeing um, some people there uh, laying their flowers, um, paying their last respects to the president, Lekaczynski, who uh, died so tragically in a plane crash a couple of hours ago uh, when his plane was trying to land near Smolensk. We're looking at live pictures there, and here are the Poles um, laying flowers there near the presidential palace in Warsaw. Right now, though, what's happening in the country is the, the Polish premier calls for an emergency uh, meeting in Warsaw, and um, the responsibilities of the president are, uh, for the moment, taken by the speaker of the Polish party. Parliament, Bronislav Komarovsky. Investigation is taking place uh, here in uh, Russia, and uh, Russia's uh, for, um, emergencies ministry sent three helicopters uh, to uh, the, the crash site. Um, the investigation committee is headed by uh, Russian Prime Minister uh, Vladimir Putin. Also, Poland said that they will be conducting their own investigation. Right now, though, uh, it's still um, we, we're getting some. Uh, information that's um, being confirmed at the moment as to what really caused this plane crash. Uh, Lech Kaczynski, uh, his wife, uh, and 130 other uh, people were traveling on 2154 that apparently was 20 years old. Uh, well, we earlier heard that it could be human error. In, in fact, it was, as we heard from our correspondent, it was a combination of factors that caused this uh, tragic landing. It was bad weather combined with technical problems and human error while well, the investigation is taking place at the moment uh, with um, uh, and right now you, you, you are looking at uh, live pictures coming out of Poland and as we can see people are gathering and more and more people arrive there to lay flowers and pay their last respects